This is the second division of the Betfred Yankee Handicap. Uh, technically rates 8B or 43, however you'd like to go with it. It's a 1 by one not 25 for 3-year-olds and up. Uh, Vanquish for Josh, Mock Ross Raver for James Shea, Star Queen for Nick Driver, Top Seeded for Obi-Wan, Carol Sally for Steve Rann, Bits for Paul O'Neill, Sneaky Pete for Dan Hughes, Southern Comfort for Gray, Carol Align for Alex Cherry, Lipu Crest for Vinnie Gerard, also Fan Cooler for Anana, 72 Favourite, County Shambles for John Seaford, Lotus Lover for Mark Jones and Thornton Piccolo for Art Costello, 14 Go to Post in Div 2 of the Betfred Yankee Handicap, and they're off. Uh, there's a few of them vying for the lead, the two in the middle in the yellow, a top seed in County Shambles. Also Fane Culler in the light blue with the black hat is also aiming to try and get to the lead, the favourite. On the outside, Sneaky Pete on the middle, Thornton Piccolo. As they settle down, it's top seeded in the yellow for Obi-Wan. On the rail is also Fane Culler for Ananas. Then we've got on the rail behind, also Fane Cutter, is Thornton Piccolo for Arco Stello. In the middle is County Shambles for John Seaford, Sneaky Pete in the Royal Blue for Dan Hughes out wide. Then in behind them, you've got Vanquish in sixth in the black and red. On the rail is Mark Ross Raver. Out wide is Southern Comfort for Grey. In the middle in the black is Lotus Lover. Then you've got Star Queen in the Royal Blue. Kibitza in the red and green. Trying to push through now is Carol's Sally for Steve Ram. Then Lipu Crest and Carla line at the back. They're into the home straight. Four and a half, but just less than that. Coming approaching the fourth furlong pole now. And it's still top seeded from also Fane Culler. They're starting to jockey for position for a shot at the leader in behind. Also, Fankula being held on to as top seeded pushes for home first. With three furlongs from home, top seeded is now in front and being pushed along, but they're still jockeying for position in behind. Nothing's really taken off just yet. Sneaky Pete is into second. Also, Fankula is also still there. So is Mark Ross Raver, but it's top seeded going into the final two. Top seeded in the yellow with the orange sleeves where Obi Wan is still going nicely for home. Here's the favourite. Also, Fankula picking up nicely down the near side. Is Southern Comfort staying on? But here's the favourite. Also, Fankula taking it up with ease. Lipu Crest is pushing through for Vinnie Gerard. Down the outside, Sneaky Pete, Star Queen staying on. But it is also Fane Culler from Lipu Crest. Also Fane Culler, Lipu Crest. Also Fane Culler. The favourite hangs on. Very game in victory there. Lipu Crest came alongside the winner and tried to push through, but the horse was game on the inside. The 7-2 favourite wins. Also Fane Culler for Ananas. And that's a nice end of the season win for that one. Also Fane Killer, 7-2 favourite. Lipu Crest was second for Vinnie Gerard. Muckross Raver was third for James Shea. Star Queen was fourth for myself. And in fifth was Lotus Lover for Mark Jones.